Baby, I just got out of the shower. You can go in now. Hmm? You're still working? It's the weekend. Are you sure you want to work on that all day? You've been on your laptop since this morning, too. Not to mention, you were also late last night for doing overtime. <sighs> I know how important this presentation is, but come on. I wouldn't want for you to get burnt out because of it. Hey, are you even listening? Oh, you are? Then what did I just say? Mm-hmm, and? Ugh, fine. I guess you were listening, but still. It's not like it matters that you can multitask like that, though. I'm getting worried that you might be getting pushed back onto making that presentation because you have to. Yeah, does... Does the promotion even come after it? <sighs> a consideration, huh? Uh, somehow I feel like you're being scammed out of it, though. I'm sorry, but do you honestly think the company, you know... Uh, I guess so, but still... Well, how about stepping out for a bit? Maybe have a glass of water? Or do you want to go outside, maybe? The weather is really nice, too. It's not too hot and it's not too cold. Plus, I just got out of the shower so I can get an outfit ready already. Oh, please. I can get ready in a matter of minutes. Your beautiful girlfriend barely even needs makeup because of my smooth skin. <laughs> but seriously, how about taking just a bit of a break from it? Maybe 15 minutes? No? Well, um, 10? Uh, 5 then. Ugh, if I convince you, huh? Well, I... Okay then. How about that one thing you always want me to do? Oh, you don't have any meetings? Ah, uh, right, it's Saturday. But, <clears throat> hey, I thought it was gonna work since you always like having those thoughts, you know? It's not my fault you have high stamina. And besides, you always look for some intimate time with each other if given the chance. I already gave you this chance, okay? There's no going back now. Suit yourself, then. How about... Hmm. A massage. Yeah, I know a thing or two, too, you know. Besides, you've been sitting for the past few hours now. Not to mention sitting there all day. Have you even had a chance to get up from that chair and walk around a bit? Of course the trip to the toilet doesn't count. <laughs> You're so silly. But what else? Getting a glass of water, I suppose? Yeah, I kind of figured that'd be the case, but... Hmm, what else? You don't want to go outside. You don't want me to give you a massage either. Oh, how about a nice snack? I... I did make the mozzarella sticks last night. That'd be a good thing to munch on. Of course, no work while eating. Oh, come on. You wouldn't want to get crumbs or tear to your laptop while working now, do you? Besides, I know a good series we can watch, or even a single movie. Oh yeah, how about that? A movie. I promise we can watch whatever we want. Well, I guess horror is out of the picture since you don't particularly like that, huh? <laughs> yeah, I get it. Wouldn't want to work if there's suddenly something that would pop out of your screen or jump scare you, right? 
on. I thought that would work even just a little bit. Ugh, what else? Oh, if you don't want a massage, how about a scalp massage instead? I can massage your hair like the one time we went to that salon. You look like you're about to fall asleep just from feeling it, too. <laughs> a demonstration? Well, there's no free trial unless you unveil the entire thing, you know? Aw, I'm not distracting you, am I? You look like you're about to give in, though. Your arms are kind of getting more relaxed, too. Still no, huh? <laughs> well, you're so persistent, babe. I never would have thought you'd act like this this far just so you can continue your work. But, hey, I meant what I said, okay? If you're burned out, it's never too late to step away and just rest. You know, my mom is a workaholic and she just wants to work every time she can. I know she has a lot of duties to take care of, but sometimes, I don't know. Of course, I wouldn't want that to happen to you too. And if you're ever troubled with work, you can't always get your mouth to shut up and keep it to yourself. Sometimes it's also good to look for someone to talk about your problems. Be it, even if it's something they're not entirely related to. You never know. They might just be able to understand how you feel and how you've been wanting to get comforted. Yeah? I'm just hugging you. That's all. I know how much you like getting hugged by me, though. <laughs> Come to think of it, I kind of want some cuddles now. I just got out of the shower. Still fresh. And I really want someone to just hold me and throw me into the bed. Maybe throw a blanket on there too and just... <sighs> Taking the day as it is. Doing nothing but rest. Whoever said resting isn't part of being productive though. Your boss? <laughs> he should get a reality check for being such a workaholic. Seriously, what is wrong with people these days? Hey, I condone that kind of behavior, if you know what I mean. He shouldn't just let his workers work their butt off and not even acknowledge it. At least thank them for the hard work. That would have sufficed. I'm serious, though. You work so hard, and I barely hear anything from you about your boss complimenting you. Well, I know I don't know the entire story going on while you're at work, but... I kind of appreciate that you'd update me once in a while. But never once have I heard you talk about your boss in a good light. <laughs> what? You didn't think I'd notice, huh? But seriously... It's never a good thing to just let yourself drown in work. Mm, I'm not really doing anything, though. I'm just really telling you my honest opinion about all of this, really. And of course it's because I want to take care of you, too. I don't want to come a day that you get sick because of work. <sighs> I'd rather you not get sick at all. I want to take care of you, but not in a way that's because of something I couldn't control. I know how important work is for you, and for the both of us. But sometimes, I'd rather you just look at me and smile. Stare at me with those eyes of yours and tell me you want to cuddle, or even a slight kiss on the forehead to make you feel just a little bit better. <laughs> yeah, of course. I love spending time with you. Even those little ones, like I just said. Don't be like those people who would think twice about taking a break. They always begin to feel guilty for not being able to do anything during the day. And the next day, they just go ahead and work twice as hard for disappointing themselves. Oh, trust me. 
I've been in that situation a lot of times when we were in college. Well, at least until we met. Hmm. I don't know, actually. But... I guess I learned how to budget and play my time because of you. <laughs> I wouldn't exactly call it a bad influence, though. Why? Well, because of you, I managed to think about what I could really do. I was a bit jealous of how you were always so perfect with your schedule and all that. <laughs> yeah, I think I told you this next part. And that's how I began to really like you. I think it's great that you have a plan and that you have a schedule to follow. But I do wish we could forget about the schedule and live in the moment, you know? Mm hmm. Well, you did realize that a long time ago when you asked me to answer you. Though, I guess the same could be said and done now if you close your laptop for an hour or two for a small cuddling session. <laughs> oh, please. I'm not really going to stop distracting you until you take me to the bed. Oh? Is that a challenge? Don't challenge me now. You know how hard of a fighter I can be. You can't get rid of me that easily. <laughs> how many sides do you still have to do? Oh, wait. Halfway there, huh? Hmm. That still seems like it's a lot, though. You sure you don't want to rest for a while? It's still early, and I can always wake you up after an hour or two. Yeah, I promise. Look at you. You haven't even taken a decent shower yet today, either. How about this? I cook you a meal while you go take a nice hot shower. Don't worry. I won't lock away your laptop nor hide it from you. You'll still find it alive and running here on your desk when you come back. I just ask that you take care of yourself first before continuing. And as a small reward for taking care of yourself, I'll cook your favorite snack. Mm-hmm. Pozzarella sticks. But... You have to eat them with me, and not with your laptop. <laughs> yep, that's the roll. So, what'll it be, sweetie? Ooh, finally giving in, huh? Finally. I was actually getting so annoyed with all the typing that you've been doing. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Kinda jealous though that you're able to type that fast. Well, I guess that makes sense since you're much more tech savvy. Huh, I guess that's how you work so fast as well. Oh well. <laughs> so what do you want to do? Take a bath? Eat first? Oh, that's not a bad idea. How about... Just one movie, please. <laughs> nice. Now that's what I like to hear. Oh, now that I think about it, there's this new movie that just released about a week or two ago. I really want to watch it with you, so I never really mentioned it until now. But hey, maybe we can get some extra stacks? Maybe? <laughs> Popcorn, yeah? Mm-hmm. That does sound nice, though. Oh, we should get some drinks, too. Do you want anything? No? Oh, soda. Gotcha. I think we have, like, one or two cans in the fridge. It's okay. If we're out, I can just go down to the convenience store by the next block and buy some. No, no, it's okay. I can do it myself. 
Is there anything else you want? Ice cream, maybe? <laughs> I'll see what's available. Hmm. Maybe some chips will be nice, but... Maybe that's too much. Wouldn't want to eat too much before dinner, but... Okay. I'll just go down and see what else I can buy. Oh, don't worry. I can just cook the mozzarella sticks. They just need to be fried anyway. You stay here and go take your nice hot bath, okay? Mm-hmm. Just to make sure you're well relaxed when you get into the bathtub. Oh, and feel free to use those bath bombs there, too. Oh, come on. They're really cute, though. I already laid them out on the counter, so just choose whatever one you want to use. Mm-hmm. Just put them on the tub, and it'll do its magic. Don't worry. <laughs> All right. Now, you go inside the bathroom while I prepare your snack, okay? Okay, good. Looking forward to our little break, sweetie. 